Uh, coming up today on Raptors Open Gym Fast Break, we highlight the ladies of the Humber Hawks who refuse to lose. We think we're our best competition. We can only beat ourselves. So day in and day out practices, we're competing five on five. We just bring it. That's when we leave everything on the court. Nick Stauskas talks about his NBA idol in alley oops and anecdotes. He said it made him feel old that I was that I was guarding him and I was talking a little bit of smack. But he's a great dude, and I'm happy for all his success. And Open Gym can't stop talking about Raptors 905. No, really, you're about to see because Open Gym Fast Break starts now. One, two, three, together. Let's go, boy. Come on, Axe. Come on. Be you. Be you tonight. Be you tonight. Let's go. A big welcome to the show, everybody. I knew you'd show up. I'm your host, Agat Stefankovic, and I'm excited to share with you the lineup of basketball stories and features we have for you today. We're keeping it local right off the top and taking the fast break caravan to Etobicoke. Why? Because the Humber Hawks play there, and we're showing off the talented tales of their women's squad. Last season, they went undefeated. This year, they've got nine straight wins, and we talked to them about the challenge of being the team to beat. I feel like we get everybody's best game. I don't know what it is. We just, I guess we're on another level and they just want to bring their A game. Well, we go into every game knowing that it's going to be their best game. So we don't treat any game like they're a weaker team. We just go out and do what we do best and that's play with composure and lock down defense and we know our shots are going to fall. Yeah, I, you know, we don't really think about it. Like it's, it's kind of something that we've parked and I, I don't expect, I don't really expect any of our teams to, to go undefeated. It's just something that is adding to some of the pressure when we go into somebody's gym or they come into ours. But it, I've said to the girls, I go, if you, can, if you can kind of stand up to it and endure it, then we're going to be better off for it down the stretch in March. There's always pressure. Pressure in games, pressure in practice, pressure in school. Everyone's looking to find the negatives and they're tired of the positives. So it's like, now what can we, what can other people do to like, just pick at you, pick at you, just, it's always pressure. Six seconds to go, no Fuente. No goes to the hole. Get the ball. Holland, for three! For three, it's good! Hey, the Humber Hawks are the CCAA Women's Basketball National Champions. AJ, our coach, he tells us to forget that championship. It was kind of like, that was last year, we won it that way. We might have to win it a different way this year. So we're not, I don't think we're focused on being undefeated. We think we're our best competition. We can only beat ourselves. So day in and day out practices, we're competing five on five. We just bring it. That's when we leave everything on the court. When we get our competition level up, in practice to the point where you know they're diving on the floor they're yelling at us because of some calls were missed then we know we're close and we've got something really good i think what our team does a great job is if someone's having an off day uh, our bench players come on and they step up and everyone has a role on this team some of these girls are for sure lifetime friends and uh, i can't wait to see them in 25 years from now and have that reunion and just be able to celebrate and talk about our memories that we've made Getting to know like the rookies, the vets, and just building um, relationships because after basketball is done, you're going to kind of remember the jokes you had in the change room and uh, jokes on the court or all those different types of situations. You know, I always tell them that the, the team that you have to worry about is the team in this change room and take care of things in practice, compete at a very high level. And, and work at executing our stuff and, and, and we'll be able to play and be in a game against anybody. If we go undefeated this, this year, that would be amazing, but our goal is play each game, uh, new possession, get into practice, compete, and get to the finals and see what happens there. We're, we're looking at the end goal for sure, like it's in the back of our minds, but I think it's each practice, each game, each possession, I think that's what we're really focusing on and not the long-term goals. Last year was a dream team basically. Can we repeat? Who knows? But that's, we're still writing the story, so we'll see. And good luck to the Hawks on the rest of their season. And you know what? While I'm at it, good luck to this next team as well.